Bitter cold and the snow is pretty much miserable for all of us, but when you add a disability, getting out of the house can be a real challenge. And that's when a group of some 100 volunteers comes in to pay it forward. Yeah, they make sure that people unable to see can still enjoy some freedom. They've been doing it for more than a century. Tonight, let's meet Club Vision. And just a nice venue for sight impaired people to get together get out of their homes and talk with folks that know what it's like. It's time for a nice meal, some entertainment and reading at Club Vision in Salt Lake. We provide a, a meal, we provide entertainment, if we need to we provide transportation, all at no cost to the patrons. The club was created way back in 1908 by the wife of Utah Army officer Andrew S. Rowan to give her blind brother a place to have somebody to read to him. So we're 105, 105 years old this year. Today, Christine Allred and many other volunteers meet three times every week at Granado's Deli on Redwood Road to bring stories and images to people who often can't see it all. We receive no government support. We raise all of our funds from private individuals and foundations. It takes tens of thousands of dollars to provide this great service every year. And we want to help Club Vision keep paying it forward for at least another 105 years. So Christine, meet Lynn Stevens of Mountain America Credit Union. So on behalf of Mountain America Credit Union and KUTV, we would like to present you with $500 in cash. <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> we hope that'll help with, uh, with some of the expenses and other things. Oh, it will. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. You guys like the club? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Hey, they could use more volunteers. We have contact information on our website. Just go to KUTV.com, click on Pay It Forward, and we do have a link there to Club Vision's Facebook page.